those fighting for Biafra and Oduduwa Republic are irritant, Alhaji Tanko Yakasi claims. An elder statesman, Alhaji Tanko Yakasi, said in an interview with Vincent Kahlo that all the individuals seeking for self-determination and those agitating for Biafra and Oduduwa nation are irritant. According to Saturday Sun, the 96-year-old founding member of the Arawa Consultative Forum, ACF, also insisted that the debate about true and fiscal federalism is absolute nonsense. He maintained that poverty caused by unemployment gave rise to Boko people in the Northeast, bandits in the Northwest, Fulani headsmen and farmers clashes in almost all parts of the country, kidnapping, armed robbery and other crimes. He told Vincent Carlo that federal government not to think that they are the ones with the solution to the problem of insecurity in the country. He advised that they should hold meetings of experienced security operators, retired military, police and other security agencies. When this large number of experienced people comes together, they will be able to develop some ideas on how to tackle all the security problems. Chief Tanko alleged that federal government will always be in trouble if they try to handle the problem of insecurity without the help of security personnel mentioned above. Speaking on granting amnesty to the bandits as a way of halting their criminal activity, Chief Tanko recalled an event that took place during the time of late President Omar Musaya Adwa. According to him, the late president appointed a minister who made recommendation that was okay by both parties. A meeting was arranged and the militant listed all they need from federal government like giving them jobs, giving them scholarship overseas for studies, giving them some allowances, etc. He implemented it. And we don't hear any war by the militant. Tanku advised that a minister should be appointed who will make the recommendation with some secure security personnel involved. When Vincent Carlo asked Alhaji Tanko what he thinks about those agitating for Biafra and Odudua Nation and some groups in the South South who give international oil companies notice to vacate the region, Alhaji Tanko told Vincent Carlo that those agitating for Biafra and Odudua Nation are irritants. He capitated that anyone who doesn't want to stay in Nigeria or do not like the way things are done in the country should provide an alternative or say it out, just like he shared his own opinion. He revealed mm -hmm. that if Nigeria is broken, the problem Nigeria is facing will also follow each unit to this different zone. He advised the agitators to bring the formula they believe will work for them in their different countries and try it in Nigeria first. He concluded by saying that complaining is not a positive thing. What do you think about this opinion? Thank you for listening to this news. Um, my viewers, Alaji Tanko Yakasai mm -hmm. is a is an elder statesman, a very known elder statesman. He has been very, very positive and um, outspoken uh, person. You know, in fact, his um, opinion has been very, very, uh, uh, very, very uh, contising. Since I've been listening to him, I don't know of you anyway, but he, he has been, you know, he, 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 has been, he, he has been speaking sense most of the time I listen to him. Okay, you take a look at uh, this very opinion that he has brought, but there is something that I want to um, still, uh, uh, I, I would like to counter in his opinion. Uh, that statement he made, he made about people who doesn't uh, 
wants one Nigeria. You understand, sir? You see, you won't say what you have just said because you know people believe in that. In that, you know, people call for division because because of the attitude, because of the attitude of the administration, because of the character put up by the administration. You understand? Okay, like let me take the ex the, the, the example of Henry Shield. What Henry Shield uh, earlier said concerning those still uh, supporting Bari and his administration. He said anybody still supporting Bari and his administration should submit his or herself for medical checkup. So what are you going to say about what Henry Shield has just said? See, that is how people feel the way people feel concerning this country is different from the way you uh al haji tanko is feeling you should understand now so in fact some persons are completely frustrated that they don't even want to have anything to do with uh, this administration you know they are feeling they are feel they are, they are feeling so frustrated so worried you know they don't believe that yeah it is this truly president more worried of nineteen of two of 2015 so you would not blame them because a lot of things have happened during this administration you know a lot of people you know so many things happen now See, okay you look at the number of people that died in the north it's very very abnormal it's not normal in any way and you know that it's not normal how can we be recording uh, and deaths in hundred in thousand on daily basis in the north if we don't record it in Katsina, we'll record it in Kaduna. If we don't record it in Kaduna, we'll record it in Bono. It's not okay. Okay, look at the opinion that you just brought right now. Very fine, very okay, very beautiful. It's very fine. You've made a point. Do you understand? Your point, I love it. I love it. And that is, if only Bwari we, uh, we adopt that system, it will really go a long way. It will go a long way in helping to solve some problems. Some problems. You see, the one thing I, I, I don't like about mm -hmm. this administration is that this administration do whatever they like. They do whatever they like. They don't, they don't put people into consideration. They don't do put into, into consideration. Okay, look at what you, talked, you, said, you said now. That is, the, 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 if the president wants to take decision on, on insecurity issue, hmm? on security issue, they, they should make sure that this decision is not taken by him personally. Rather, he should consult professionals who have retired in that field. That is one problem this administration is having. They do things on their own. They don't consult people whenever they want to make any professional decision. In the aspect of economy, if I want to do things concerning the economy, like a, like a borrowing of fund and um, you know, you know. Uh, uh, transfer money into the into the reserve and all of that it does it without proper consultation of professionals and that is why till today we are still owing a very huge amount of money called debt you understand so um let me go out there and listen to what other people are actually saying concerning all that you have just said right now because to me you, you really made a point anyway but i believe that there are still other opinion out there that needs to be put into consideration all right so let me hear from them if you are new on this channel do it free to leave your comment below the comment section click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos thank you